All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Hey, so some of you guys have been asking what I've done to my car, what it is. Is it a Z01? Is it an SS? Um, so most of you know it's an SS. I do have a Z01 conversion kit on the front end, and that's because my SS bumper was damaged during a hurricane. So I spent the extra money and got the Z01 front end. Uh, which I'll show you in just a second. I'll kind of give you guys a walk around the car, show you what I've done. As far as mods, as far as uh, looks and stuff, and kind of tell you the companies and stuff that I got my my uh, my products from. So without further ado, let's get jumped in. All right, guys. So the car is a 2018 2SS Camaro. You're probably asking yourself, okay, what is a 2SS Camaro? Well, basic uh, way I can explain it is the 2SS has everything in the car. It's got leather seats, it's got power everything. Um, I think it's basically about it. It's got the standard uh, 6.2 motor in it. So as you can see, sorry for the, the dirtiness. I just got back from a uh, car trip, but you can see it's got uh, the leather interior. I have painted the uh, SS, the Kryptonite Green from the 2017 model. Um, it's got navigation, six speed. Um, it does have a sunroof or moonroof or whatever you want to call it, um, which is awesome, which is what I wanted. Um, again, it's got power everything uh, inside. And then outside, it's, the, it's the, the, the double black, right? So black paint, black rims. Um, and then that is your standard uh, 2SS package. Okay, so as far as what I have done to the car, so as you can see, yes, that is a Z01 front end. Um, it does have the, the Z01 um, fog lights on it as well. I do have a tow hook, got it off of eBay. I have made my own uh, front splitter. So it does have the Z01 uh, front splitter and then I've got my own uh, front splitter underneath that to protect it. Uh, that is made out of ABS plastic. Again, I've made it myself. I created the template based off of this Z01 uh, design. As you can see, it gives it a very, very aggressive front end. Um, and then obviously it's got some splitter rods. These splitter rods here are stainless steel. They will not rust. I've had them on the car now probably two months. No issues whatsoever, which is phenomenal. Uh, so walking around the side, I have used a paint pen. So I'm running the triple nickel, the Nitto triple nickels. Um, as far as tires go, I have powder coated my calipers. Um, so shout out to Major League Powder Coating. Check them out on Instagram. Zach is amazing. Moving along the car. So if you don't know, the car is Bruce Banner during the day and he's Hulk at nighttime. So this emblem here is from Louver Labs. Check them out on Instagram, the Louver Labs, uh, for all your badges and accessories. So continuing to move around, I do have an American Authority gas cap. Um, I gotta get it replaced. As you can see, it's uh, it's starting to fade. Uh, I might just get a uh, a new one or get this one repainted uh, to match it. Uh, side skirts are from Gorilla Splitters. Those things are awesome. Um, held up very well, or they're holding up very well. And then the rear side skirts. Uh, again, I made these myself out of the same material that the front splitter is made out of. So moving up to the top of the back end, I do have a wicker bill. This wicker bill is from 3D Engineering. Uh, check them out on Instagram. So 3D, 3DE 2016, I believe is the Instagram. Uh, awesome product, never had an issue with it. It's super thick. Uh, as you can see here, it's probably about a quarter of an inch. Um, gives the, the back end a super aggressive look. I did recently change out my taillights for the smoked uh, ones. I got these ones off of eBay. Um, 
I think I paid like two ninety five or something with them. They are the LEDs, uh, the LED lights. I do have the LED brake light as well. Um, as far as exhaust, so if you look under the car, as you can tell, there is no more suitcase under the car. So what I've done is I've done a secondary cat delete and a muffler delete. Gives me a pretty good growl um, when I'm running the car. Can't really hear it on the inside, so I think I may do something a little more aggressive, uh, but time will tell on that one. So continuing to move around on the driver's side. So same thing, splitter, splitter, louver labs, major league powder coating uh, for my calipers, my front splitter, Z01 front end. And again, I've got louver labs has custom designed a Hulk tag for me. The car looks super, super aggressive. Uh, coming down the road all right so let's move under the hood as you can see so if you know hulk he is inside of bruce banner if you will so i have hulk uh, i have green underneath the car or, or kind of protruding from the car if you will and then as you can see hulk is always inside so let's move inside the uh the engine bay Okay, so moving inside, K&N air, k &N cold air intake. I do have the, um, the sway bar, which is awesome. Tightens up the front end. I have painted this uh, gloss black. The same company that painted that also painted this front end here. Uh, that company is called Wicked Paint in Fort Walton Beach. Uh, check them out on, on uh, Instagram. Wicked Paint FWB. Uh, Keith is awesome. Um, as you can see, I do have green throughout uh, the engine bay as well. I hydro dipped the fuse box cover myself. I also created these covers here. And the reason why I created those is because I have a bunch of wires uh, that I've done my best to tuck them away. But during shows and stuff, you can still kind of see them. So it's one of the, uh, the things that judges mentioned was, you know, trying to tuck all those wires away and make it look pretty. Um, I do have a coolant cover that I bought off of Amazon. I think it was like 60 bucks. Awesome. Again, just trying to make the engine, engine bay look a little more, uh, a little cleaner, if you will. Uh, there's, those are my green snuggles, or hood vents, if you will. And again, the Hulk comes out at nighttime, so Hulk smash uh, for the win. All right, as far as the trunk goes, uh, nothing major in the trunk. I do have a 10 inch sub, uh, Memphis Audio sub in there uh, with a Pioneer amp uh, underneath here. Um, I will post a picture of what the trunk looks like for the shows, which displays the amp and everything for show okay so you're probably saying all right there's nothing super special about the car um, but I would beg to differ so the car yes it looks like a standard uh, SS with some Z01 and some uh, minor modifications here and there but the biggest modification I've done to the car is I had a company called ground zero custom in Pace Florida um, they put on a set of vertical doors so what I mean is so the door opens opens probably 60% and then I can open it all the way up so this is kind of what the car looks like in show mode except I've got the other door open as well um, ground zero custom awesome awesome company Chuck and uh, Chris phenomenal crew uh, just opened up a new shop so they were in Holt Florida they moved up to Pace because they needed a bigger shop uh, check them out ground uh, ground ground zero customs on Instagram uh, for all your modification needs all right so like I said the car during the day his Bruce Banner he's nice and tame as you know as you've seen through all the movies um, and then at nighttime, the Hulk comes out. 
and he gets angry. Uh, what I will do now is I will pause here and I will insert what he looks like at nighttime and you guys tell me what you think uh, or what your thoughts are about the, the, the car at nighttime. All right, guys, so that's my 2018 2SS Camaro. Uh, everything that I've done to the car. Um, I've got to give a huge shout out to my boy, Phil. Uh, if you want to check out his build, we have done some massive upgrades, kind of like I have with mine, uh, on his 2021 Dodge Charger Scat Pack wide body. Uh, check him out on Instagram. Uh, it's Cap America 2021 um, on Instagram, so check him out. See uh, see what we've done for his build. Um, if you got any questions, let me know uh, where I got products. I will try and link them, or I will send you the link on where I got it. Uh, but the car is phenomenal. I love it. Wouldn't trade anything about it. You're probably asking yourself why I didn't get a ZL1. Uh, and the reason is I couldn't justify spending the extra twenty twenty five thousand dollars for a supercharger and maybe some suspension upgrades um that's basically the big difference between my car and the zl1 is the uh is the supercharger and then like the magnetic ride and stuff like that um but so what i've done is i've made my car the 18 ss 2ss uh my own zl1 or my own version um, so, all right, just tell me what you guys think. Yay or nay. If you got any other questions about mods or stuff, let me know. Make sure you hit that, uh, that bell, hit that subscribe button. Uh, let's continue this journey on, uh, together. All right, till next time. I'm out.